Hi, this is Tom Mullaney, Digital Learning Coach at Gravely Hill Middle School in Eflin, North Carolina. This video is about voice actions for Chrome. It is a Google Chrome extension meant for people with disabilities. As a former for 10 years teacher of exceptional children, this is a topic that's very important to me. And I think this uh, Chrome extension has some real potential. So here, if you look at some of the features, it can use spoken queries and the touch of a mouse or the touch of a finger on a touch screen to open up web pages, to do searches, to do calculations, to switch to different tabs. If you look here, these are some of the examples that they give you. Let's dry run a few of these. So let me show you one of the cool search features. You could just search for Google, but you can do with some others here. Search YouTube for the Young Turks. And so while it didn't quite search YouTube, but it brings up a bunch of Young Turks related uh, YouTube listings in the Google search. So that's kind of cool. I like how it did that. So that's one option that we can do. Let's talk about, let's, uh, let's do a calculation real quick. And if you notice, there is a little bit of a lag with the clicking but it's not that bad. Let's do a calculation. Calculate eight plus three times two. Uh, there it got, it cut me off. Let me try that one more time. It brings you to that website where it does it. It actually does the order of operations correctly. Calculate eight plus three times two. So there it did it correctly and you see that it's a kind of a beta and you sometimes have to do it a little quickly. Um, but again, that's pretty cool. I'll do one last thing I think that's kind of cool. Listen to this one. Switch to Twitter tab. So as you see, it switched to my tab that had Twitter up so you can switch to tabs with it. It's something that maybe not perfect, but does have some potential for users with disabilities. I am Tom Mullaney. Here's my Twitter at EdTechTom. Thank you for watching this. If you'd like to discuss further, please comment below or tweet me at EdTechTom.